I'm Debbie Homer Davis from babylady.co.uk and welcome back to the store today where we're showing you a series of different push chairs that you may not be able to come in and see at the moment because perhaps you're stuck at home and we've had lots of comments from customers saying that they're finding these videos very helpful and we'll go into as much detail as we can today to show you how they work. So this is the Maxi Cozy Zelia. It's really fantastically value, good value for money, and particularly if you're on a bit of a budget, you don't have a huge amount to spend, um, or if you don't want a carry cot, a separate carry cot, this may also um, be something that might be great for you. Um, so we're gonna start by showing you how it works. It's got a nice little hood that comes up and down. Uh, this is the black, uh, which is my favorite color that it comes in, but there are other colors. Again, you can see them at our website babylady.co.uk so the difference with this with some of the other push chairs we have is that it doesn't have a separate carry cot it has a um, just a fabric which is supported by a series of straps and this does actually allow you to adjust it so in the first instance we can have our baby in the flat position and that is by uh, letting down all the straps under here now it won't have a mattress it's not suitable for overnight sleeping obviously um this is tremendous value for money normally it retails at 299 we do have offers on this uh, quite a lot of the time as well and um, particularly in bundles with car seats so do check out the best prices on the website when you're watching this but um if you are on a budget it does offer good value for money but somehow somewhere you have to take something out otherwise you'd be paying for something like the the nc or, or, or another product but it it does work and it works really really well it's completely flat um i'm a huge advocate of how important it is to have your baby flat it's better for their breathing it's better for their digestion it's better for back support in, in so many different ways and this will allow you to have your baby completely flat when they're newborn you will need to harness them in because it's not a proper carry cot so it does have harnesses in here you can adjust it as your baby gets a little bit bigger so if i take the apron off here you'll be able to see the bassinet it's this is probably the way best way to describe it. it's like a little bassinet okay as your baby gets a little bit bigger what you can do i'm um, best way to do this i think i'm going to take the seat unit off to do this actually so to take your seat unit off you've got two little catches on either side the gray ones here and you can take them off and turn it over. So I think that is my parasol clip. Um, if I turn it over, I think you'll be able to see the series of straps under here. So when you are adjusting it to sit it up, what you need to do is adjust the foot strap here like this. You can adjust this one as well. And then you can adjust the back with these two clips here. And you can just press this together so if we put it back on the push chair, let's try and locate it in like that, um, you'll see that now we have adjusted the angle on that seat unit. And then if we want to sit it up, there's two buttons on the side that you push in. And can you see how we've created our push chair seat unit rather cleverly out of the um, out of the fabric pieces just by adjusting it so you won't have as many adjustments on something like this but you got to bear in mind at 299 pound normal rrp it's phenomenally good value for money it does have an adjustable bumper bar like this and you can say you can recline it you can put it the other way around you can take the seat unit off it comes with adapters included so that you can put a range of the maxi cozy car seats onto this and sit it up it doesn't sit it's fairly upright and that's in your forward facing position you've got a hood here and you have also got some ventilation which obviously we know is quite important i should have said that on the carry cot piece especially if it's going to be a day like today when it's going to be absolutely beautiful um, it's got a tuck away flap at the front if you don't want that visor it's not the longest hood we've seen but it still gives you quite a lot of coverage there and you can always add an additional canopy you can actually fold the seat unit up so if you are short of space the seat unit will actually fold up and that's what this button is for here you can actually bring the backrest together 
you can actually fold it up. So if you have a small car, I say we actually got it in the boot of the um, the iGo this morning without folding anything up. We did have to take the wheels off the chassis, but we didn't have to do anything more than that. So to fold up your chassis, and we've got an adjustable height handle. Uh, let me just measure that. I don't think it's hugely high, and there's not a, a massive amount of adjustment. But to be fair, for average people, it should be fine. Um, a hundred and... I reckon that's about 104, 104 centimetres, maybe 105. So to fold it up, what we have to do is there's two handles here. You lift those and your handle will go over like this. And then you just pull this up and it squidges together. It's very light. It's very, very light. I'm sorry I don't have the, the um, actual uh, weight of it, but it's it really is very light i've got a bit of a back problem and that's tremendously light and then just pop it back out literally just comes back out super easy to use very very simple so if we wanted to put a car seat on this we regularly have bundles available on this which i think i said on our website you should be able to see them just pop the adapters in the adapters are included in the price of this package so there is no extra to pay for those we take our max cozy cabrio just in there you could also put a pebble or any of the other uh, pebble plus pebble pro range of different car seats on this push chair as again you can see obviously we don't recommend that you use um, car seats on chassis for long periods of time because it's not good for your baby's breathing or their uh, development but obviously if you do have your lay flat seat unit so this is the maxi cozy zelia we think it's very very good value for money if you do want any more details do contact us at babylady.co.uk Thank you for watching today.